Sivco Medical Solutions offers a wide variety of head and neck treatment products, allowing customization for each patient treated. Reproducible patient positioning and fixation is important for providing precise dose delivery to the head and neck. Thermoplastic-based systems assist in providing accurate positioning and immobilization and are comfortable, easy to use, and cost-effective. During this presentation, we'll demonstrate three Sivco head and neck positioning systems, as well as related treatment accessories. Our Type S, PosiFix, and Uniframe systems each offer a high degree of patient stability with ease of use for the clinician. Most head and neck treatments can be performed on any of the systems, although some advanced techniques are best performed with the Type S or PosiFix. Both the Type S and Uniframe systems feature a constant frame docking approach. This ensures the mask material is always tethered to the docking frame, resulting in a more uniform tension throughout the mask. The PosiFix system allows a clinician to drape the thermoplastic material over and around the patient. Sivco's head and neck positioning accessories increase the adaptability of each system. After an immobilization system is selected, the patient setup simulation begins. Once simulation is completed, the mask is marked to assist in creating a reproducible setup. Then the treatment plan is created. Once planning is complete, the patient is repositioned on the treatment table and the treatment cycle begins. This video will review the patient setup section of the process. We'll begin with a few basic instructions and then demonstrate the type S, PosiFix, and Uniframe systems in order. Finally, we'll discuss advanced head and neck treatment accessories, including the AccuForm cushion, individual head support, and precise bite repositioner. Sifco head and neck products are designed to handle a wide variety of patients in therapeutic situations, and there are some basic instructions that apply to all product use. In all cases, Sivco products should only be used by order of a physician. All disposable products are intended for use on one patient only and should not be reused for additional patients. Disposable products include, but are not limited to, all thermoplastics, AccuForm cushions, the individual head support, and the precise bite reposition. To help minimize potential shrinking of any mask, ensure the mask is completely cooled before removing from the patient once formed. The cooling process can be quickened by applying Sifco's Cool Mitt or a cool damp towel to the mask. All masks should be removed from the patient carefully, keeping in mind any sensitive areas on the patient which the mask may contact during removal. Always clean the mask as necessary and store the mask in a clean designated area. The Type S offers unsurpassed versatility and ease of use, providing stability for the head, neck and shoulders. The Type S extends off the couch top for treatments in a 360 degree arc. The Type S system features minimal attenuation and is CT compatible. It accepts head only or head, neck and shoulders thermoplastics and is indexable with a two pin lock bar. To begin setup, index the lock bars to the tabletop. Then align the Type S overlay with a lock bar and place the overlay onto the tabletop, connecting with the lock bar. If extending the overlay beyond the table, secure the overlay via the Velcro safety strap included. Be sure never to extend the overlay beyond the board's prominently displayed safety marker. Once the overlay is securely positioned, select the appropriate head support and mask for the patient's setup. The Type S accepts Silverman, AccuForm, the individual head support and vac lock head supports, as well as PosiFix head supports with an adapter plate. In this case, we are using the Silverman head support. With the head support in place, position the patient. In order to guarantee mask clearance, check that the patient's shoulders are within the borders of the base plate. On the standard Type S board, this may require using a shoulder retractor system on certain patients. If using the Type S fixator, make sure that the patient is positioned so that the shoulder retractor setup markings can be exposed. Align and pre-position the patient. We are then ready to proceed formation of the thermoplastic mask. For this demonstration, we will be using the IMRT, Reinforced Head, Neck and Shoulders Mask. For warming times and temperatures, refer to the thermoplastic heating instructions in the Civco Instructions for Use. After the mask has been heated for the appropriate amount of time, carefully remove the thermoplastic mask from the water bath. Swiftly dab it to remove excess water, 
and then begin pulling it over the patient, being attentive to molding and forming it to the pronounced bony landmarks of the patient's contour. The nation and the mandible region serve as reliable contour points. If using a full head and shoulders mask, be careful that the mask does not gather in the neck section, but rather remains smoothly contoured against the neck. Perform final corrections, taking advantage of the mask's pliability before hardening. If using the fixator, once the mask has completely cooled, begin applying the longitudinal pressure to the shoulders. Continue to apply pressure until the desired retraction is achieved. Record the retracted positions on the setup sheet provided. Mark the mask as needed and begin simulation. Once the simulation or daily treatment is complete, release the mask from the base plate by gently pulling the safety pins upward. Carefully lift the mask up and off the patient. Sivco's Zentech thermoplastic material offers another immobilization option. Zentech forms to the patient's features through a smooth draping method, resulting in enhanced facial contouring for improved repositioning and fixation. Zentech masks combine rigidity with an easy forming process, require less warming time. The constant frame allows Zentech thermoplastics to be formed by one person. On many Linac treatment tables, a type S head extension may be a desired option. If so, simply attach the Type S extension to the exposed head end of the table by angling the extension upward and inward, aligning the extension to the table's docking mechanism, and leveling flush. The extension is now ready for both the patient and accompanying Type S mask supports. The Type S system provides a high degree of stability for the head, neck, and shoulders. The system has minimal attenuation, so it is ideal for IMRT and conformal treatments in a 360-degree arc. The numerous headrest and thermoplastic options provide a setup option for almost any patient. We'll now discuss the Sivco PosiFix Head and Neck System. Sivco's PosiFix Head and Neck Positioning System is highly adaptable. PosiFix base plates accommodate a wide variety of head only and head, neck, and shoulder thermoplastic masks. Available base plates vary from base acrylic head base plate to a more sophisticated carbon fiber IMRT base plate. The PosiFix system is a two-pin ready and can be indexed to the table with a lock bar. To begin setup, index the lock bar onto the tabletop, then align the PosiFix base plate onto the lock bar. If desired, the Sivco couch top cover can be positioned against the base plate for added patient comfort. Once the base plate is securely positioned, select the appropriate PosiFix head support and mask for the patient's setup. Three and five point PosiCast thermoplastics are available in a variety of types. Traditional PosiCast provides a soft polyurethane coating on both sides of ultimate patient comfort and handling. PosiCast Plus has polyurethane coating on the side that comes in contact with the patient and a smooth outside for easy marking and PosiCast Lite includes a smooth coating on both sides. Here we are using the PosiFix 2 base plate and a PosiCast 3 point thermoplastic mask. PosiCast thermoplastics should be heated in a water bath set to 70 degrees Celsius, 158 degrees Fahrenheit for one minute. Sivco offers an array of head supports compatible with the PosiCast system. These head supports range from the PosiFix supine head supports to the PosiFix contoured head supports, which provide a deeper contoured fit. PosiFix prone headrest and PosiFix pediatric headdress. In addition, custom molds such as AccuForm and the individual head support are also compatible options. With the desired head support in place, position the patient onto the base plate. Align and pre-position the patient. Next, carefully remove the thermoplastic sheet from the water bath being mindful not to allow the sheet to fold over upon itself. Swiftly dab the mask to remove excess water. Align the mask over the patient so that the mask's opening falls upon the patient's upper lip region. Dock the lateral handles of the mask to the base plate, using the white positioning points as a lining guide. Secure the handles with a quick fastener system. Next, capturing the superior end of the mask's material atop your hand, gently stretch the material and handle down towards the base plate, again using the white positioning points as a guide. Secure the handle with a quick fastener system. Once all three handles are securely docked, gently stretch the mask's opening 
wide to allow protrusion of the patient's nose through the mask. Now, begin contouring the mask to the nation and chin, using a gentle forward motion to fully form the mask over the chin, in order to set the mold and to prevent the thermoplastic from reverting to its original shape, holding the mask in place for a few seconds. If desired, additional repositioning points can be formed to reference the patient's ears. Be mindful to perform final alignment for the patient before the mask hardens, usually within five to 10 minutes. Once a mask is firm and completely cooled, mark the mask as needed and begin simulation. Once the simulation or daily treatment is complete, release the mask from the base plate by gently pulling the quick fasteners upward. Carefully lift the mask up and off the patient. Both the carbon fiber PosiFix 2 and the acrylic PosiFix 4 are designed to accept a 5-point PosiCast mask, in addition to the standard 3-point version. Initial setup is identical to the process just demonstrated. Two people are recommended to perform this task properly, with one person assigned to the head section of the mask and the other to the shoulder region during fabrication. To fabricate a 5-point mask, have the technician designated to the head end capture the superior end of the mask's material and gently stretch the material and handle down towards the base plate using the white positioning points as a guide. Secure the handle with a quick fastener system. Once the head region is securely docked, begin to address the shoulder region. Initially, each technician will work a lateral side, forming the thermoplastic around the shoulder with a slight S-turn movement. This movement will ensure that the shoulder is properly captured. If using the PosiFix 2 base plate, be sure to dock the handles down into the holes nearest to the patient's shoulders. Once the shoulder handles have been docked, if using the PosiFix 2 base plate, be sure to dock the handles down into the holes nearest to the patient's shoulders. Once the shoulder handles have been docked, each technician will now turn their focus onto their specified area, one forming the mask at the head while the other concentrates on pushing the shoulders down. Setup of the PosiFix system is complete and the patient is now ready for simulation or treatment. Once simulation or treatment is complete, Release the mask from the base plate by gently pulling the quick fasteners upward. Carefully lift the mask up and off the patient. The PosiFix system provides an efficient system for head and neck positioning and fixation. PosiCast thermoplastics create a highly contoured patient mask with minimal shrinkage for increased patient comfort. With many headrests and thermoplastic options, PosiFix is a versatile head and neck positioning option. The third CIVCO head and neck positioning system is a uniframe system. The uniframe head and neck fixation system provides rigid immobilization for enhanced image quality, as well as consistent patient posture. Available in carbon fiber or acrylic, the indexable base plates feature a cutout area under the head support for visualization and treatment. They utilize easy-to-use swivel clamps for locking down a variety of thermoplastic mask options. To begin setup, place the base plate on the tabletop, aligning it onto the two-pin lock bar. Once the base plate is securely positioned, select the appropriate head support and mask for the patient's setup. Uniframe is compatible with Timo, Silverman, and Accuform cushions. For this demonstration, we will be using the Silverman headrest with an IMRT reinforced mask and a carbon fiber base plate. For warming times and temperatures, refer to the thermoplastic heating instructions in the CIVCO instructions for use. With the head support in place, position the patient onto the base plate. Align and pre-position the patient. Next, carefully remove the thermoplastic mask from the water bath, swiftly dabbing it to remove excess water. Begin pulling the mask by first capturing the patient's chin and then align the mask over the nasion region so that the reinforced strips rest partially down on the nose and over the brow. Once aligned, pull the mask over the patient and dock the frame to the base plate. Mold and form the mask to the pronounced bony landmarks of the patient's contour. Perform final corrections, taking advantage of the mask's pliability before hardening. Then allow the mask to cool. Mark the mask as needed and begin simulation. Once the simulation or daily treatment is complete, release the mask from the base plate by turning the swivel clamps. Carefully lift the mask up and off the patient. 
The Uniframe is an industry standard and one of the most popular systems available. It provides a simple, easy to use head and neck immobilization option. The variety of headrest and thermoplastic options provide patient customization for each head and neck patient. Finally, we'll discuss and demonstrate three advanced head and neck accessories. In this section, we will cover AccuForm cushions, the individual head support, and the precise bite patient repositioner. Both AccuForm cushions and the individual head support are custom made, patient specific head supports. Each provides enhanced patient repositioning in the superior to inferior plane, as well as custom contouring for cranial shapes not sufficiently cradled by the standard head supports. As each device is fabricated specifically to the patient, it becomes a dedicated, permanent mold and is not reusable for any other patient. We'll begin the demonstration with the AccuForm cushions. Select the appropriate cushion size and remove the cushion from its airtight package. The cushion should not be removed from its package until the time of use. The cushion demonstrated here is 20 by 25 centimeters. Sifco also carries cushions in a wide range of sizes. Mist the cushion thoroughly with a spray bottle and gently knead the cushion to ensure proper dispersion of the water throughout. Wipe off any excess water. The AccuForm cushion may also be used in combination with a Silverman head support. If using a standalone AccuForm cushion, be sure to have the AccuForm indexing bar in place. Next, position the cushion into either the indexing bar or the base plate and pre-shape the cushion to help guarantee proper flexion. Position the patient onto the cushion and begin forming the cushion around the crown and neck region of the patient. The goal is to form the desired neck extension of the patient while additionally creating a cranial contour that will enhance superior to inferior positioning accuracy for patient placement. Be careful to make sure the cushion will not interfere when the mask is docked down to the base plate. Once the AccuForm cushion is sufficiently stable, usually within three to five minutes, continue with the patient simulation setup. When the simulation is complete, be sure to place a patient identification mark on the AccuForm cushion. The AccuForm cushion is now ready for the treatment cycle a paper drape may be used on a daily basis for sanitation. We'll now demonstrate formation of the individual head support. The IHS is available in two different shapes, the neutral shape for setups requiring a more level position for the patient's cranium, and the hyper shape for those setups requiring a more pronounced flexation of the patient's chin and neck. Select the shape appropriate to each individual setup. Here, we'll be using the neutral shape, IHS. Each IHS kit consists of a base plate, impression foam, and a cloth-covered thermoplastic sheet. Bases are available in both Type S and PosiFix compatible forms. The impression foam provides the initial support and contour, and the thermoplastic sheet provides the final support and contour for the IHS. In simulation, position the IHS onto the base plate and pre-position the patient onto the impression foam without compressing the foam ensuring proper patient superior to inferior placement. Then carefully lift the patient up off the impression foam, keeping the patient superior to the thermoplastic sheet should be placed in the water bath at this time. Remove the thermoplastic from the water bath and carefully dab away excess water. Dock the sheet onto the base plate using the protruding prongs as docking guides. Once the sheet is secured, guide the patient onto the IHS and carefully compress the patient's head into the impression foam via the forehead and chin, using a gentle but firm downward motion. This compression will cause the thermoplastic sheet to form around the patient's posterior cranial side. To avoid creating a sideways impression with the patient's head, it is best to apply the pressure from directly above the patient. Allow the sheet approximately five to 10 minutes to cool and harden with the patient upon it. After this, the remainder of the patient setup can proceed as required. When combined with an advanced frameless fixation system, the IHS can play an integral part in the department's stereotactic cranial treatment program. The Precise Bite is a custom positioning accessory designed for enhanced positioning accuracy and increased immobilization of a patient within the thermoplastic mask. The Precise Bite is available in standard and small sizes with or without a tongue depressor. Each Precise Bite consists of a moldable mouthpiece that once heated conforms and registers to the patient's upper teeth. The Precise Bite's unique docking assembly affixes the formed mouthpiece to the thermoplastic mask. 
To begin setup, remove the backing plate from the mouthpiece assembly, keeping the backing plate within reach. With the patient in initial setup position on the head support, immerse the mouthpiece section of the precise bite into boiling water for 35 seconds to soften the mouthpiece into a moldable state. For warming times and temperatures, refer to the precise bite heating instructions in the CIFCO instructions for use. Once fully heated, carefully remove the precise bite from the hot water and dip it into a container of cold water for three seconds to prevent burning the patient's mouth. Carefully insert the mouthpiece into the patient's mouth, visually checking that the mouthpiece is properly engaged onto the upper teeth and that the lips are closed naturally around the docking stem. The patient should bite down on the precise bite. Once formed, remove from the patient's mouth, dip into cold water for 10 seconds. The precise bite is now fully formed and set. Reinsert into the patient's mouth and the precise bite is now ready to be joined to the mask. Begin pulling the mask over the patient, docking the frame securely to the base plate. Swiftly clear the thermoplastic over the mouthpiece's tines, clearing the way to engage and lock the backing plate. You will hear a clicking sound that signals it is secured. The thermoplastic can also be formed up and around the lower plate to add additional stability to the precise bite. However, this will result in the precise bite being permanently affixed to the mask. After this has been accomplished, move to the other areas of the mask such as the chin and nasion and complete the contouring of the mask to ensure optimal setup. To clean the precise bite, use an approved oral antiseptic. For advanced head and neck setups, CIFCO offers AccuForm cushions and the individual head support for custom cranial contouring. The precise bite enhances positioning accuracy and increases immobilization within the thermoplastic mask. All three devices can be used in conjunction with all the systems presented here today. During this presentation, we've demonstrated CIVCO's three head and neck positioning and immobilization systems, the Type S, PosiFix, and Uniframe. We've highlighted several different base plates, head supports, and thermoplastics, as well as shown CIVCO's two-pin indexing system. Three CIVCO advanced head and neck positioning and immobilization accessories have also been covered. AccuForm cushions, the individual head support, and the precise bite patient repositioner. Modern radiotherapy requires strong assurances that the defined target, once located, remains correctly positioned under the beam at all times. CIVCO products contribute to the dependable and accurate patient fixation, helping ensure that the image you see is the image you treat. We hope this film has familiarized you with a variety of head and neck products offered by CIVCO, as well as given you basic understanding of using some of these products. Our aim is to provide you with the ability to customize treatment to each patient. For more information about CIVCO head and neck positioning systems and accessories, contact CIVCO at 800-842-8688.